COVID-19 is a disease that's caused by a virus, and this is a virus that has never been seen in the world before. Viruses mutate and change all the time. This is why you can get colds over and over again. You don't just get a cold once and then you're immune forever. Um, the virus can change and cause a new cold the next year. This is a brand new virus that we've never seen before, and the virus is causing this illness that's called COVID-19. The way you know you have COVID-19 is you have a fever, you have fatigue and body aches, and a cough. And that sounds a lot like the flu, and it sometimes can be hard to tell the difference between the flu and COVID-19, and your healthcare provider can help you to do that. So if you develop symptoms of COVID-19, you should contact your healthcare provider, and they can help you to sort through that. The reason that we're worried about COVID-19 more than a usual flu season is that no one in the world is immune to COVID-19 and there isn't a vaccine like the flu shot yet this year. So we're worried that lots of people could get COVID-19, which could make it hard to care for everyone in the way that we're used to. There's a lot that we don't know about COVID-19, but one of the things we do know is that it's spread through respiratory droplets. And what this means is it's not spread just through the air, but when people cough or sneeze or blow their nose and they don't cover their mouth and nose when they do those things, little droplets can get on surfaces or on you if you're very close by, and that's how this virus can be spread. This is why we're asking people to keep a distance from each other and to cover your coughs or sneezes, to wash your hands so that if any of those droplets are on a surface that you touch, you don't touch your eyes or nose or mouth and then get infected that way. This is also why it's not important, and in fact, it's not helpful to wear a mask if you're healthy and you're just walking around outside or if you go to the store. You need a mask if you're sick so that those respiratory droplets we were just talking about don't get spread to other people. And if you're caring for someone who's sick, like you're one of our nurses or respiratory therapists or patient care assistants, you need a mask to protect yourself from those droplets. But if you're just out and about, you don't need to be wearing a mask and we should be saving those for the people who need them.